decided that I would apply for a thoracic fellowship at Massachusetts General Hospital since it's probably the top thoracic fellowship in the country. My name is Esther Park. I am Gina Harvey Barnes. My name is Karen Rodriguez. Patrick Burgoyne. I'm a chest cardiac imaging fellow at Mass General. I'm a cardiothoracic fellow. I'm a thoracic fellow at Mass General Hospital. I think the MGH Fellowship is a very comprehensive uh, experience for anyone who wants to be a uh, cardiothoracic radiologist, meaning that there are a lot of opportunities in both research and clinical involvement. The environment for research is really conducive. You get all the mentoring, you get all the resources, you get everything under one roof, whatever you need. We get to see it all here, which is really exciting. There's lots of mentors here and they're all involved in lots of research projects and they are very good about bringing on fellows early on so that you could get involved in lots of different projects. We usually take five to six fellows a year. So it is pretty big uh, compared to other programs. Most programs only take one or two. We had a great group of fellows this year. Um, we all got along very well. We were able to get to know each other. We were all in one reading room. Um, I think if it weren't for my co-fellows, it would have been hard to get through the year. We encourage each other. We um, help each other out. We had a great time together, both professionally and socially. Uh, professionally, everybody knows a lot, and everyone comes from a different background. I'd say my favorite parts were the teaching that we got. There's kind of wide range of pathology that we see in every single case. There's always a lot of teaching that goes into each and every case, whether it's from radiographs to CTs to MRIs. We do nine months of thoracic and three months of cardiac. We do lots of lung biopsies. And then on cardiac, you do pretty much a week of CT or a week of MR, and it alternates. The directors were very kind in allowing me to to tweak my schedule and let me have more time on the cardiac uh, side so that they were flexible in that way and supportive in that way. All of the referring clinicians and the physicians at the hospital are really wonderful and great to work with. They're very approachable, they make you feel like you're all on the same team and everyone's goal is to care for the patient to the best of their ability. It's not just the readouts but you also have access to so many different multidisciplinary conferences. So many, you have a hard time attending all of them. You can pick and choose which ones you um, want to attend. My experience in research has been outstanding. I would say nothing beats MASH and well. I have multiple presentations in RSNA, which is the largest meeting of doctors anywhere around the globe. And I have had multiple presentations at American Lung and Race Society. It's very easy to get involved in any project that you'd like and we have a lot of resources in terms of writing, uh, statistical analysis. It's a really great place for people who is interested in research or academic projects. And uh, Boston is a great multicultural city and there are a lot which you can do over on the weekends if you want to. Uh, you can commute very easily to work um, and you really don't need a car in Boston. I spent a lot of my time just, you know, visiting the nearby restaurants and also doing kind of all the touristy things. We go to Bunker Hill, uh, visit North End and all the restaurants there, and uh, visit the aquarium, commons, and, and the gardens. So. It's a great city to live in. There's also a lot of uh, things to do surrounding Boston. You can go to, to Cape Cod or uh, other places up north. Um, so in our free time, there's definitely a lot of things to do. I'm Joanne Shepard, and I'm the director of the Thoracic Imaging and Intervention Division at Mass General Hospital. Mass General Hospital is a very special place to be. It has a very strong radiology department that's subspecialized, and it has very strong clinical staff across the board. The fellowship also is unique in the sense that we have a full spectrum of responsibilities covering all modalities. We have at least seven ICUs, uh, surgical and medical. We are committed to training all of our fellows broadly so that they are prepared to do whatever comes their way in their career. As a fellow lines up a prospective uh, position at another institution, we want to make sure they're prepared to do what they need to do there and also to support their individual interests. There is a curriculum of courses specifically tailored for fellows. So early in the year and um, even towards the end as well, we have one-hour courses 
uh, for several weeks on various subjects. This curriculum allows us to uh, learn more about really specific aspects of thoracic imaging that we may not encounter frequently enough during clinical practice to really be comfortable with. Another great aspect of this program is the staff because they don't just care about making you a fantastic thoracic radiologist, they also care about you as a human being. You get to know everyone pretty well working with them one-on-one -on -one every day at the workstation and everyone does really seem to care about each other and work as a team. The fellowship was great, the quality of the teaching I think it's obviously one of the best. I would definitely encourage people to apply and come here. I think they'd really like it. You can't really go wrong with the Thoracic and Cardiac Imaging Fellowship at MGH. There's a lot of everything for everyone. The MGH Fellowship is pretty much as good as it gets when it comes to cardiothoracic imaging.